everybody, what's up? My name is PrankStars101 and welcome back to Undertale! So we just got finished becoming besties with um Undyne. <laughs> and uh we are now going off to continue our precious adventure. Yay! Okay, I am pretty sure that we're going to be going to Alphys next. Alphys is a lab. Okay. Let's go, shall we? Wrong way. Welcome to Hotland. Sweet. Nice. Oh, hello, you're new. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Okay. Music sounds creepy. Seeing such a such a strange laboratory in a place like this, you feel a determination. Hi. Oh, it's you. Hello. Okay. Uh, let's talk to you. Sorry, I'm dying. Like, told us there were totally a uh, human in the area. So, like. Us royal guards are blocking out the elevators for now. Nah, even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. I'm not Undyne. <laughs> Love. Oh, hey, it's me. It's you? She's so cute. I love Alphys. She's one of my favorite characters. Oh my god! I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... Eh. Eh. Um, hiya. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. B -b but, uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of rooms, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but why does someone on the screen really makes you real for now? So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I felt him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments, like, um, anti... Anti-human combat features? Of oh, course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I had to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. And, um... Now he's an unstoppable killing machine was a source for human blood. 
But, um, hopefully we won't run into him. Hmm? Did you hear something? Yes. Oh no! It's on. I personally like the voice I chose for both of him, just forms, but no. Oh yes, welcome beauties. <clears throat> to today's quiz show. Woo! Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone, give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly, or you die. Oh, the music man. Cry. Screaming, screaming is against the rules. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Right, sounds like you get it. The quiz show continues. Dear George O'Reilly, I promise. What's the game's full name? As for TV, I need it. Correct, what a terrific answer. For those of you who don't know, Alphys will give you the answers. Some of them honestly tricked me. <laughs> Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Too easy for you, huh? The push will continue. Here's another easy one for you. Oh god! She knows. Wonderful, I'm astounded, folks. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? How do you know that? Correct, you're so lucky to win. Let's play memory game. This is what confused me. You think it'd be a frog, but apparently it's medical. <laughs> I'm so flattered you remembered. But can you get this one? Would you switch a ghost? <laughs> Heck yeah! Great answer, I love it. Here's a simple one. How many letters are in the name at the time? Okay. Of course, that was easy for you. Time to break out the big guns. Please give me a kiss the cutie. Oh, oh, I know this one! It's the last one! The poor chapter everyone was engaged, and she buys ice cream for all of her friends. It's male flavor, and she's the only one who wants it. And one of her favorite parts is because it's especially very proud of the of friendship and the... Uh... Oh my god, so much talking! <laughs> Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our contestants, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Whose daughter Alphys have a crush on? And die! See, Alphys, I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrolls her name in the... Margins of her notes. She names programming va variables after her. She even writes stories of them together. You write fan fiction? Oh, it's so cute! Sharing a domestic life. Probability of crush 101%. Margin of error 1%. Well, well, well. With Dr. Alphys helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this, but, but, this was just a pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darling. Okay, bye. Well, that was certainly something.
It sure was. Wait, wait. Let me give you my phone number. Then maybe with your help I could. Well, where did you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second, please. Oh god, what are you doing? Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting items. It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> hey. Hey. I'm going to the best. Okay. Woo! I do! Alright, we need to play crab up one here. Good for now. Because the fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles. Yes. You got the instant noodles. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. It's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game, or... It's a video feed of your location. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. <laughs> Space between behind the wall is only a few feet wide. Uh, what's this? Someone told me. What? You're in her room. Get out of it. Unless um, she invited you. No way. That did not happen. <laughs> Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Sign up to. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. <clears throat> human history. Fine, we'll read one. Look inside a book. It's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in his mouth. Seems like it's late. It doesn't strike you as very accurate. Ooh, wait a second. Hold on, wait a freaking minute. Is this with Yandere Simulator? <laughs> Because I remember, I don't know if it's with the actual game, but I remember watching this Yandere Simulator video where Yandere, with, where uh, Yandere Chan was late. I remember her, like, she was late for school and she was, like, running with toast in her mouth. Like, that said. And she met Senpai. Is that about Yandere Simulator? I hope to God it is, because that would be awesome. Goop. Drinks from the strange machine. Looks like Alpha's work table. Seems dusty. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed falls into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> it's a promo poster from Metatown's TV from here. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. Just real has an ant watch undone. Fight the human. Anna! 
Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. He. <laughs> For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Cold space. <clears throat> Vulcan strolls in. We need to encourage him. So Vulcan is doing a great job, and the attacks become extreme. Ah, ah, that was my best. Oh, God. Forty gold. Ooh, nice. Can I call him in a minute? It'd be nice if you call me now. Not in a minute. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, Alveo. <gasps> thunder Plane! For those of you who don't know, Thunder Plane has a crush on you. Thunder Plane had a crush on the human! You need to approach. Be close to Thunder Plane, but not too close. Human! Touch the green. See, he's blushing! Ah! Hey, look how cute he is! And he looks over and it turns up his nose. Cool! Tell Summer Plate I have a power for once. Huh? You sicko! Oh god! Satisfied, I think, then. Oh, God! Ah! Oh, 
I can't even read that now. Look at my heart! Oh god! There! I think I got to 45 gold. I don't know. Oh god. Better call me. Blue lasers, uh, I mean, I'm just here, hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. The uh, orange ones, um, you have to be moving, and they, um, they won't, um, boost your nose one? Uh, bye! What? Oh, I'm sure I did it. I was gonna shut my fist if I died calling me after the weather. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why'd she call me? She likes you. No! So troubling. Why is it so troubling? I don't even know. <gasps> Should do a frozen trip. The box has to be permission. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Yay!
figure this out. dark here. Hey, it's kind of dark in there. Um, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and bring it up. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> Bad time. Oh, yes. Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. Ooh, I love cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone get them a big hat. Yay! We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. I don't know why he calls you those things, sweetheart, of course. Of weird. Okay. You found the sugar. You found the milk. You found the eggs. Here you go. Yay! Perfect. Great job, beautiful. Uh, thank you for the compliment, I guess. We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, what a magnificent moment. Wait a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We've been, we're missing the most important ingredient. A human soul. Oh no. Hello? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. W wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean, use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan? Oh, well, I mean... That's a brilliant idea, Alvin. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand, always convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. How convenient! I look like there's like a demon face on the front. <laughs> well, darling, why don't you go get it? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get that can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. F fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? Watch this. Jetpack! Oh my god, that's awesome. 
There! You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there! I will. Eggs! My, my, it seems you bested me, but only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alfred. Oh, I love to think what would ha have happened if to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. You baked the cake? Where is it? Wow, we... We did it! We... We really did it! Great job out there, team! Well, uh... Anyway, let's keep heading forward. Click. He said he made a cake! Cake? Is this the cake right here? Where is my freaking cake? It's an oven. Looks pretty much. Where is the cake? Well, oh dear God, that that music's terrifying. An ominous structure looms in the distance. Your fellow determination. Ooh, core view. S see that building in the distance? That's the core. The source of all power from the body on the ground. It converts geothermal energy into magical. So I passed through that without reading it fully. Whoops. Ah, uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. And the cores and Alfie are directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Yay! <laughs> Please select the location. Um. Let's go one. Oh, it's here! They're gone. Oh god, they're gone. Ugh. Why are they why are they gone? Oh, we need to go on brick floor two. Hello. Hey, I'm Har I'm Heat's Flansman. Remember my name. Okay. Sans. I love hot dogs. Hey, isn't it weird that there's snow on that guy's roof? That's he's just too lazy to clean up. That is weird. <laughs> Toasty bun. He said, stop. <laughs> Hey buddy, what's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30G! Sure. Thanks, kid. Here's your dog. Yeah, dog. Apostrophe dog. It's short for hot dog. Yay! Hot dogs! Hot dog? Hot dog kills 20 HP. Meat is made of something called a water stick. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, um. Hey, buddy, what's up? Wanna buy a hot dog? It's only 30 gold. Yeah. You're holding too much. Because I just put it on your head. Oh. My God. <laughs> Here's another hot dog. It's on the house. Well, no, it's on you. Here, have fun. Here's your fun. 
I just keep putting hot dogs on my head. <laughs> I don't mind, I love hot dogs. Oh my god, I can just keep putting hot dogs on my head! <laughs> this is amazing. hot dogs on your head. Thirty is just an excessive number. Twenty-nine? No, that's fine. But thirty? Doesn't look like my arms can reach that high. You know? Oh, good God! <laughs> There's so many hot dogs on me. Oh! Whoops! Hot dogs! My hot dog? Sorry, gold. Another hot dog. Here you go. Whoops. I'm actually out of hot dogs. Here, you can have a hot cat instead. A what? <laughs> hot cat. Hot cat. He'll try my feet. Like a hot dog, but with little cat ears on the end. Oh, so cute! Cat ears. That sounds adorable. Dinner with the girlfriend! It's a picture of a cat doll figurine as to a little bit of noodles. Cool skull to 95 was the picture. I think this is the virus. Are we posting hot pics? Here is me and my cool friend! Yep. <laughs> it's a picture of the virus flexing in front of a mirror. He's wearing sunglasses. Giant muscular biceps are pasted onto his arms. The biceps are also wearing sunglasses. God. Oh, cool skills in 95. Not a joke, right? <laughs> the only joke here is how strong my muscles are. <laughs> now it's the book. Yeah. It seems to have over. Oh. Now it's the book. It's okay. Apron lying on the ground. Oh. Yeah. Alright, hang on. Yes. You got the stain aid? Armor defense a Heals one HP every turn. Master Chef, basically. I got the freaking bird pan and stain apron. I'm a little kid chef. <laughs> Hi, it's Dr. Alphys. This puzzle is kind of, um, timing based. Y you see those switches over there? You have to press all three of them within three seconds. I'll t try to help you with the rhythm. Okay, now press the server. Hey! Doesn't he make it look like you? Oh, 
only needed to pass two of them. Okay. Oh. God. That's lost if I try to help with a puzzle. No! Uh, hey! I'm not too bad at solving. I miss you now. I think that means for a bit. I, I'm sure you can help this puzzle yourself. I did what? Better than Mimi one? Well, that's a joke, right? During the mouse fight one day, hack the computerized safe and get the cheese. Put it to starvation. Yay! There's a piece of cheese inside this computerized laser safe. The lasers have melted the edges of the cheese and stuck through the tape. That's a microwave. Not. Alright, well. I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. I hope that you guys like this. If you like it, please give it a like. If you'd like to see more in the future, please subscribe. Hope you guys like this video, and I will see you in the next video. Till then, bye bye